Hey guys, it's Allison. Welcome back to The Tiny Herd, where we talk about everyday pet care for guinea pigs, rabbits, and other small pets so you can keep your pets the happiest and healthiest they can be. Today's video, we are doing a haul. I have three big Amazon boxes of things that I got for the pets. I just fully stocked up because I kind of got in a routine of being almost out of things and having to reorder like every month. So I just went full out and stocked up on a ton of stuff I'm gonna show you guys today. Also, some of this stuff is for future videos, so I'll tell you a little bit about that, but let's just go ahead and jump into this haul. All right, so all this stuff is from Amazon. I will leave links down below so you guys can find stuff for yourself, but I'm just gonna start grabbing stuff and show it to you, and if it needs explanation, I'll give you the explanation then. So, first up, we have some pellets. So I am switching all of the pets to the Oxbow Garden Select pellets. So this is a four pound bag of the adult rabbit food. The bunnies are actually already eating this um, because we ran out of their pellets, so I had to mix it in earlier, but I did get them a four pound bag so that we are stocked up. And then I also got an eight pound bag of the rabbit pellets as well. Then I did also get the Oxbow Garden Select adult guinea pig pellets. I am switching everyone over to the same pellets, honestly, because I got tired of buying Sherwood pellets from Sherwood's website, getting Oxbow pellets from the pet store for Georgie and Jellybean. Like, I just want everyone to be on the same pellets. These are pretty good. They have pretty good ingredients, and they're easy for me to get in the pet store or online. So I'm just switching everyone to these. So I did get three bags of these for the piggies so that I can fill up our pellet container and then also have backup for them as well. I am just grabbing stuff but the next thing um, is for a video so I'm just going to explain a little bit what the video is going to be. Um, I'm doing a video comparing the easy access popular brands of hay from Amazon. So I did get, oh gosh, this bag of Oxbow Western Timothy hay because I'm going to be doing a video, like I said, on the popular brands of hay. I don't use Timothy hay, which you probably know if you are familiar with my channel, I use bluegrass because I'm very allergic to Timothy hay, but most people use Timothy hay, so for video purposes, I got Timothy hay. So I got the Oxbow, and then I also got the Small Pet Select second cut Timothy Hay as well. And then I got, this is the Vitacraft Fresh and Natural Timothy Premium Sweet Grass Hay. So this is Timothy Hay also. So like I said, I was doing the popular easy access ones that you can get on Amazon. So I literally put in Timothy Hay for guinea pigs and then picked like the top four or five that came up. So that is three. And then, oh yeah, then I have this bag of American Pet Timothy Gold Premium Timothy Hay. And then last we have the KT brand All Natural Timothy Hay. So I'm gonna leave links for these, but again, I'm going to be doing a video comparing these. So these are not necessarily brands that I recommend for hay. They're ones I'm going to be comparing based on a bunch of different factors. So just wanted to make you guys aware of that. So that is five brands of hay for that video, which should be up next week sometime. Then the rest of this is just some pet supplies that I got. So I will mention also, I didn't show it because I've already like put it away, but I do use the Small Pet Select Natural Paper Petting for Snickers Mouse and in the Bunny's Litter Box. I did buy three big 178 liter bags of that. I'll grab one of those at the end of this video and show that to you guys just so that you can see what it looks like. But I found a deal for three bags for $100, which is cheaper than if you buy three bags individually. So I went ahead and did that because we do go through that bedding pretty quickly with the mouse cage and with the bunnies. Next up, I'm just gonna start grabbing stuff out of these boxes. I actually have showed you guys the majority of it, but let's go ahead and just grab things. So I did get these two woven grass mats. The These are for the bunnies. The bunnies really like to um, chew and dig and tear these up. So I got these as kind of a boredom breaker for them. 
And then I also got, this is yes, a baby toy, but bunnies really like to throw things and, you know, toss things around. So I thought this would be really good to like hide treats in between the cups, you know, and then they can like grab them and toss them without, you know, breaking anything or hurting themselves or anything like that. So these are a really cheap, good um, enrichment toy for bunnies if you have bunnies. That is everything in this box. So we are moving on to this box. Okay, next up from this box, I have a bunch of microfiber rugs for the pig cages. So I have a couple different sizes and different colors. So this is a smaller one, obviously in blue. I got a black one, same size. Well, this one's bigger actually. This one's bigger, black one. Um, and then I got two navy ones of the smaller size another navy one and then another big black one so these ones i really like because they don't have like the netting on the back that some actual like bath mats do because that always ends up getting like gross in the washing machine and like tearing and then the pigs want to chew on it so a lot of my microfiber rugs i've literally had for like five years i got them when i first got the pigs so they are a little worse for wear at this point so i went ahead and just got a bunch of new ones in some neutral colors so that they look good with all of my fleece and all of my cage sets so got a whole bunch of these again will be linked down below because people ask me where i get my microfiber rugs all the time so here they are okay next up i got the pig some toys so in this bag there are I think five, yeah, five of these Willow Balls. These are the Wear brand. These are the ones I've always used with the pigs, but they love, love, love Willow. All of them do. And I really like these as a chew toy because it's all natural. They can't really get hurt. There's no unsafe things, unsafe ingredients. Um, just be sure like when it gets kind of small towards the end when they've chewed a bunch that if there's like sharp sticks or like anything they could like put their head in and get stuck you take it out but usually with the balls I don't have that issue so I did get a pack of five that are in here because like I said they love their willow then I also got a pack of five of these willow barbells these are also wear I'm pretty sure yep so I've used these before too they really like them they're just like two mini balls on a stick so these are great for enrichment toys for piggies as well. And again, nothing unsafe, no unsafe pieces or ingredients or anything like that. All right, guys, so that is everything in this haul. Totally stocked up on pellets and hay and some natural chew toys. So that is everything that I got the pets over the last month or so. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed getting to see this kind of stock up pet supply haul. If you did enjoy this video, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I put up new pet related videos every Friday and I'm trying to do every Tuesday at this point as well. So thank you again for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.